Good, thank you. Do you consider this today a successful event? Yeah, today was really successful. We had over 3,000 runners come out and run for such a good job, uh, good cause, the Drive In Hunger and Hosea Williams Feed the Hungry. Good, so tell me a little bit about why you started Black Girls Run. Right, Tony and I started Black Girls Run in 2009. At the time, um, we had been running for a few years and really we're getting questions from our friends and family on how do we get started with this running thing. So we thought it'd be great to start blogging about it and give like culturally relevant information. Um, and from there we launched the running groups and it's just grown. So it's been your dream. Tell me how do you get an idea, have a dream, have a vision and make it come to a successful event like this? Right, right. Well I think it's, it's honestly one of those things that's kind of placed in your heart and I really feel like God, He, he placed His vision in our heart. And I think every time you step out on faith, and you know how they say you take one step toward God, towards God, and he takes even more towards you. So he's really just provided. The provision has always been there. Um, amazing people cross our path. And every time we keep stepping out on faith and pushing to ourselves even a little bit more, just he overwhelms us with just the abundance of surprises and good things happening. That's awesome. So where do you go from here? What's your next step? Right. Our next step is really to, first step is to take a nap. Exactly. <laughs> Because it's been such an incredible weekend. But from here, we're really looking to launch more groups at the beginning of the year. Um, we're going to have another year, another race and conference next year. Um, we have C to 5K programs coming out. So we have a lot going on for 2013.
Well, Black Girls Run, we really want to encourage um, African American women to live a healthy, active lifestyle. To really take the time for yourself, to take the time out and run, to be to get your cardio in, just to be active because it's not about so much what the scale says. It's about making sure that you have a quality of life that um, you know, fighting diabetes, fighting obesity, fighting heart disease, fighting all these chronic diseases that are plaguing our community, um, and really just living the best life that you can.